the closest Eurovision Song Contest I've seen for a long and time. And winner, it was absolutely amazing. Of the Eurovision Song Contest 1981. It was a great thing. And we can't really knock it because it gave us our career. With 136 points. Silly old Eurovision, but it was great. We won for, for our country. Is the United Kingdom with making your mind up. If I'd have known at the time how it was going to change my life, I'd have, well, I'd have probably got even more excited than I did. Sung by Box Fizz and composed by Andy Hill and John Danter. Heavens! <laughs> and once they ripped the skirt off, quite frankly, I think we all held our hands up and went, that's it. And on the words, you want to see some more, pull skirts off. I don't know whose idea it was. If the public hadn't seen the performance... I was driving a clapped-out old Vauxhall Viva estate and the guy had just bought himself a Ferrari. <laughs> and so I thought, maybe I'll start writing a few. If only they sold as many records as they sold newspapers, we would have all been millionaires. Well, I suppose I did become a millionaire, but, you know, <laughs> the others might have been as well. There was never any, like, real screaming, shouting matches or anything like that. We used to get along. And she got up and stormed out. And I thought, well, if that doesn't get an Oscar, I don't know what will. Well, he was a bully. He was a bully. You are the weakest member in this band. Well, that's when it all changed. If I had been a cow, I know I had. I didn't think I deserved that, though. If I lose everything I have, just get me out of the band. People have left, and as someone's left, I've replaced them. You and your heart so God almighty. Did they get on? Um, sadly not. <laughs> The snowfall in Land of Make Believe was, was, was magical. It actually, it gives me a bit of a shiver as I'm talking about it. I signed one of the worst contracts in the history of the music industry. Hot property there. I answered back. David Van Day. I'm making your mind up.